All right, here we go. This is one of my favorite ways to, um, to catch fish. Fly fishing with surface poppers for big fish in shallow, clear coral water like this. <laughs> the odds are against you pulling up these size fish, even with heavier conventional tackle, but it's hit five times harder on fly gear, but I just absolutely love the challenge. Big mangrove jacks, even bigger flowery cod um, are your opponents in this country. Um, and that's what they are, they're opponents, because this is like the heavyweight boxing division of fly fishing, because the fights are just short, brutal, and violent, and they don't last long. And normally you lose more fights than you win, but, um, but I'm still happy just to sign up for that. I definitely got home ground advantage here. You know, the fish are under all these rocks. And you gotta watch out for sharks too, because they're lurking around. Bang, there it is. Oh, that's the worst place to hook him. Oh, this is 100% over. Game over. Way too big. Oh, oh. Ah, he's gone out the back door. Oh, he's gone back door. He's gone. Broken off. Look at that. It's like a fish bowl in here. Oh, that's cool. Look at that. That's a, I think that's a nurse shark. It's only his own private jacuzzi in here. Oh, that's awesome. Wow. Not a worry in the world. Just gotta dribble it past this ledge. Jack, bang! Oh, trouble early! Big trouble! He's deep under. Major trouble. Oh, it's looking for the back door exit. Uh, don't tell me I'm still in this. Shit, shit. Ah. Oh, shit, it's caught on something. Shit, what's the fucking caught on? Shit, what's the fucking caught on? He's still there, he's still there. What's going on? Shit. What's going on? What's going on here? How am I still in this? He's still deep. Shit. Oh, neither, of, neither of us are giving up here. There he is. Oh, it's a big unit. Here he is. Here he is. Shit. Oh. Oh. How do you not bury me under all that stuff? I've no idea how I've caught you, mate. Oh, look at the thickness of this cod. What a beautiful animal. Oh, he's a heavy unit. Nothing but respect, mate. Good battle. Oh, there's no way in the world there's not a cod or a jack under that ledge. Bang! Oh! oh. Two cod. Oh. Just try and get him to take it. Watch a bit further out. That's it. Got him. Yep. Oh, got him. Ah, oh. ah, there he is. There he is. He's cooked. There 
There you go, mate. Godspeed. Sharks are on him. Mate, you better surrender or you're gonna get smashed. <laughs> Shit! <laughs> oh man, he was gonna mistake my foot for a trevally. Or oh, play trevally. Try to use me as a decoy. Bad, mate. Uh, just black lip oysters everywhere. In. I just saw a tiny little tip of a tail um, coming out of that shallow water possibly be a feeding blue bastard. Yep, there he is. Oh, it's a big one too. Yep, yeah, he's in a feeding posture, so that means I'm in with a chance here if I don't cast up. Alrighty, step A complete. All right, step B, pretend my fly is a scared crab scrambling away. Yep, bang, oh, bang, got him. Solid fish. All right, step C is get out of the fly line spider web. All right, step D, enjoy the moment. Hang on, back to step C. All right, you just gotta keep that, keep low blowing them here, keep the rod facing down to try to get their heads pointed to the sand because their uh, big tail becomes sort of ineffective then. They can't get as much propulsion if they're facing down and you can almost halve the fight time. Oh, it's a good fish though. But in saying that, you gotta keep your rod high if he gets over any reef or rubble like that, because that'll snap you off. It's a big unit. Look at that, it's just a really pale version. Such a nuggety little fish, the blue bass. It's so pretty too. Just one of the best flats fish is here in the territory and they just absolutely love crab flies. Oh yeah, there's a stingray over there. Looks like he's got a fishy friend with him. Yep, he's turned. He's turned, he's on it, he's on it. Oh, I don't know what that is. He's solid though. Oh, trouble, trouble. Back. What does that look like? It looks like a tusky with a blue bone. Love these guys. Definitely one of my favorite fish on the flats. Look at that. Always punch above their weight in terms of how they fight these guys. Just love the demeanor of these fish and all their, their color patterns. It's just spectacular. Just love them to death. Man, I love these fish. Yep, nice doing business with you again, mate. Yeah, croc tracks. Yep, that's a man eater size. He's just heading into that freshwater catchment up there. His tracks are going in one way and they're not coming back out, so he's still in there. Yeah, I reckon I'll just respect my place in the food chain and not fish this place. Jesus. There's got to be crocs in here. This place just reeks of barren jacks, cod maybe. Yep, oh, solid fish. I think it's a cod, I think it's a cod. Oh, it's a goldie. 
golden snapper. Beauty. Beautiful looking fish. Great eating, but most importantly for me, great fun on the fly. Well, they just shat on me. Let's get you ready for the prom again. Gold bomber flies don't get um, eaten if they they don't look pretty. Got a big fly on. There's big there's bar out there. There's bazers out there. Oh yeah, it's gonna sit nice on the top too. Yep, bazer. Ah, oh, oh, nice solid one too. Yeah, they just had to be here. Ah, oh, awesome jumping fish. Beautiful coloured water here, like that deep green. Come to the airbrush, show us off. There we go. So, such healthy fish in this system. Just caught a million of these. Just caught a million of these guys um, on fly nets. Never get bored of that strike. This is like an electric jolt going up your line. That strikes one of the best in the business. Anyway, off you go. Look at off. Yeah, on these remote beaches, um, the bigger sharks can have predatory fish just tag along with them because I think A, because of protection, and B, I think when the sharks cruise along, they sort of scare crabs and, and little bait fish and they try to scatter away, and that's when the predatory fish hit, particularly golden trevally, you know, brassy trevallies, GTs, cobia. You know, they all do it along this, this beach in particular. So it's always worth your time having a cast at these sharks. Even if you can't see them directly, they could be behind them or under them or just around them. <sighs> no, way too slow. Way too slow. That was too slow to cast at that guy. I think it looked like a big GT. You know, over the years, um, we've just noticed that the bigger GTs have a much shorter um, hunting arc or feeding arc. You know, they come in, do a drive-by to check out if they can corner any mullet or milkfish um, against the water's edge, and then they just beeline it back out to deeper water, like that guy. They don't like being too shallow for too long. Um, but the smaller ones, they do a sort of a longer sweep and make a longer arc. Um, along the shore and I think the smaller ones actually spend time um, trying to dig up crabs and um, hunt little smaller fish they sort of do more investigating along these beaches more sharks Are you kidding me Oh, there we go. Some G's with it. Shit. Some fucking G's with them. At the back. There we go. Here we go. Here we go. There we go. There we go. There we go. Doesn't know he's hooked yet. But really sticking to it. Here we go. He's gonna take off soon. There we go. There we go. Now, the problem is these 
sharks. I'm gonna want a bit of him. Shark out the back there, big one. Here he goes, he's coming in now. Look at him, shark is 10 meters behind it there. That's an awesome fish. A beautiful spectral fish. I think you're safe over there, Brasco. This tree reeks of mangrove jack. It's got to be a couple hanging off there. They love this setup. Something on there, it's got to be. Just got to be something on that log. No way in the world that doesn't hold a predator. Let's sink a little bit, get into the eye line and no. I refuse. Refuse to believe that there's not a jack on that. Just here, the gun too wide. Just in the sense that that is the best snag, the first snag on the long beach always has good real estate for here we go there he is there he is there he is he's a jack it is a jack there we go <coughs> you gotta keep his head down oh shit there we go he's a bit shallower Nice one too. Look how thick and healthy these fish are around here. They're just get. Go. Awesome. Not a bad one. Be another. Oh, there's a jack there. Little one. Oh shit! What's that? What is that? Oh, oh, oh shit! He still wants it. He still wants it. That's a big queenie. <laughs> That's cool. That's cool. And what? Have I got him? Smashed it. You keep their head pointed at you. You don't have to go with that fight for too long. You can end it here. It takes off, we're in trouble. Keep his head pointed at you. There we go, we got him now. No, we don't. Yes, we do. That's a big queenie. Just hasn't gone to the air yet. Come on. There we go. There we go. He's not that long. But man, he's fat. Solid unit. There you go. Oh. Wow, this area is crazy beautiful. Paradise for sight fishing. 
water quality and the structure is just perfect around here. There'd be nasty, teethy, predatory fish all under those cliff undercuts and in those dark shadows around those rocks. I fished long and hard today though, um, so I think I'll fish this another time. The cricket test starts in a few hours and I've got a bit of a run home to get back to the, um, the telly to watch it. And watching test match cricket and fly fishing are my two greatest passions in life and unfortunately, like days like this, they clash. Um, but I've had a pretty good run with the fly rod so I want to watch a bit of cricket but I'll definitely go back to this little pocket. This is superb. If you're new to Fishing the Wild and enjoy our content, then consider liking this video and subscribing to our channel. It helps us keep creating more free episodes. You can do this by hitting the like and subscribe buttons below and head to the description area of this video and click the links that will take you to our Facebook and Instagram pages where you will find more Fishing the Wild related content. Catch you later.